It's me, Sarah. Welcome back to my channel, The Empowered Light Leader. Please subscribe to this channel if you want to receive channeled messages and light language activations to help you step into the truth of who you are. So it is New Year's Eve and I am doing this special New Year's Eve meditation and activation with Sekhmet, the Egyptian goddess, and the primordial dragons, guardians, the white dragons, the black dragons, the red dragons, and the green dragons. So this morning, as I was waking, I had a vision of the earth and surrounded by four dragons, a um, white dragon at the top, a black at the bottom, and then a red and green dragon on the sides of the earth. The white and the black is polarity, um, and the, the, the red and the green is transformation and healing. So this vision felt like a message. And I've been working with the healing goddess, also the warrior goddess, Sekhmet. And a lot of the light language that I bring forward is, um, you know, goddess energy, right? So there's the Egyptian goddess energy, the Lemurian goddess energy that I'm bringing forward. And I wanted to do this little meditation and healing with Sekhmet and the dragons to bring in the new year. And I wanted to um, help you bring in the new year with an intention and some sort of protection and understanding that this is a, um, a positive year ahead, right? There's a lot of attention around the negative and we want to bring in, not that we're ignoring, right? But we want to set the intention for, for what we're bringing forward and knowing that the earth is choosing, has already chosen to ascend. So everything you're seeing now is just an illusion, the crumbling, remember that. That's very important going forward into this year. Okay, there will be more, there's going to be more and it's very important that you stay strong. Stay strong in your light worker purpose, stay strong in the truth that you incarnated here to bring forward a new age and we are holding up the foundation of a new age. How you choose to step into that, again, that's your choice. Are you going to step in with fear or are you going to step in with a higher knowing, right? Once we're able to master our emotions, right? and really um, see past the illusion, we're grounded in our higher power. So now it's time to move forward and become grounded in your higher power. And this will be more people awakening, more people needing guidance, more people coming to you. You're a light worker, you're, you're feeling called, right? You're not even at that point, you feel like um, you need more understanding that's going to be happening too. And also keep in mind that 2021 was really about this um, breaking, this crumbling, all the things that had to die. So now as you really allow things to die, right, and move forward and, and what you want, because this past year was major karma clearing, okay? Many timelines collapsed, major karma clearing, um, things that felt impossible, right? We're now seeing those changes happening now. So now, dear ones, the energy is coming through, you must anchor your light. You must choose to understand where oneness is called for and you must understand what the separation is, right? So recalibrating to oneness everywhere in your life. Surtikya chertsa. So now we call forth the energy of Sekhmet, the pantheon of Egyptian goddess energy, and the white dragons, the dragons of truth, alignment, brotherhood and sisterhood, oneness, the primordial guardians of the earth, primordial gardens of fire, primordial gardens, guardians of water and air. We call upon you now to surround us with a circle of light. Allow us to embody our truth, aha, and see oneness unfold in all areas of our life. Anywhere where there is injustice, anywhere where there is separation, anywhere where there is fear, shame, guilt, regret, we ask you to aha, surround these energies with the illumination of gold, silver, and white shuha and the divine truth that we are beings of oneness. That is truly who we are. Let us heal the lack. Let us heal the separation. Let us move forward in our purpose. 
forward in our joy. Yes, let us move forward in our joy. Let us choose to see the love unfolding. Let us choose to see the love unfolding. Let us choose to see the love unfolding. This does not mean that we ignore, yes, darker parts of self. This means we encapsulate them in the light of oneness within. Now I want you to feel your body burn up in the colors of white, gold, and silver. And feel that truth, feel that electric fire, feel the dragon energy burning up any lower vibrating energies in your field. Now sing and shoot the beams of energy out of your throat. Hi echo onto the earth who you are. Hi and let the sound be the vibration that clears all negative entities and energies from your field of light. See this clearing, feel this clearing, yaha, in all directions eternally a field a plane of oneness that goes further than the eye can imagine surha that is infinity that is timeless let this clear your energetic field make this declaration now sunirdaha that anything less than the love within me is now being returned to oneness surthashirdaha again feel the dragon fire burn this up and transmute it to source we are dragon fire sur the suma we are the light within. We claim the earth as ours. Amen and so be it. Lumu kataha. Yaha. And we return to the golden sanctuary of love that is our birthright. Thank you, dear ones, brothers and sisters, for being present. Whew. Coming a little back into body now. It was very powerful. That is my gift to you on this New Year's Eve. <laughs> So please enjoy that. Uh, it's very important to be in the energy of intention going forward of what you're declaring uh, this new year. So I am being um, empowered in my own declarations as well. I am happy to announce the return of my school, the Academy of Light. I launched it about a year and a half ago, I believe. I'm bringing it back, um, stepping into the truth to activate light workers such as yourself, light leaders, that maybe are channeling or not sure of their gifts or really know they have a purpose. They want to be uh, reactivated and they're remembering. They want to remember their light language so they can teach, heal, um, channel, uh, channel for others and uh, heal others um, and reclaim and remember their, their gifts. So level one is happening. I'm launching it next week. If you're interested in that, um, the link will be posted very shortly. Um, in, in the description below, or you can reach out to me on my social media. I have limited spots for that. So again, that's level one, that's opening up to your light language, opening up to your multi-dimensional self. You're gonna receive light language activations, three of them, very powerful ones, as well as teaching modules on one-on-one -on -one work with me. That's level one, I'm really excited about that. We're launching that January. Um, I'm also going to be doing other special events, live um, events, and another um, business energetics 
um, live that's coming out if you're thinking about launching a online business as a spiritual healer not sure how to do that I'll help you navigate through the mess of all of that so please like share and subscribe uh, we're growing this channel it's beautiful I love the growth I love connecting to all of you please please don't hesitate to comment or reach out to me um, and help me grow this beautiful community in the new year thank you again for helping me raise the vibration of the planet by doing this together and I'm happy to be connected to you. Um, much blessings to you and I'll see you soon. Bye everyone. Bye.